Okay. I am so... Well, first of all, I was absolutely jamming to my own music. Uh, my intro music, honestly, it is kind of a jam. It has been a while since I've, like, listened to it fully. Um, Jesus, that's a jam, isn't it? And then also... Remember how the gym was so packed, like, a, not even a week ago? Everybody's already gone. I don't know how everybody lasts, like, two days... But for some reason, my gym wasn't busy at all. And it hasn't been ever since like the 2nd of January. I don't know what happened. I don't know why these guys are already pussying out. But get on my level, bitch. That's very... I shouldn't... That had energy that I do not want to vibe with. Um, Moving on. Who do we have in here? <laughs> Ego... With the five month race of the continued support. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you so much. Has it been five months? I feel like you resubscribed like a week ago. Jesus, time is flying by. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate that. But we got Say Your Night, Mr. Daddy Night. Just a tiny Ellen Plucks waiting room. I actually called it this time. I was, I know that from my perspective, I was late. So I was like, hmm, I might not see the message, but I did see this one. I wasn't that late. Um, look at us, huh? just a couple of meteor. Dude, you killed meteor already? D did that take you like an hour? Did you kill meteor in an hour? That's insane. Gonzo, mocha. Damn, I'm genuinely on time for a stream for once. How was everyone? Gonzo, what are you? I was like, wait. Did I truly see Gonzo over there? Good for you, man. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Good morning. How is everyone doing? Good morning to you too, Flash. I'm doing good, actually. Um, I am like fully back on my schedule when it comes to gym time. Um, where it... Like the past couple of months, I would say. Oh, wait. Now you're already gonna... Oh, that's so loud. Let's... Can I... I don't know how to turn the sound off. Uh, let's just do this for a second for you guys. Because that is very loud. Jesus, I thought I would just set it up in the background. <laughs> that was insane. Okay. Um, what I was saying is that... Ever since, like, summer... A little, like, end of the summertime. I stopped going to the gym as regularly i stopped following a routine whereas i am a very much routine kind of girl and um i could tell that i myself was just doing bad because of it um and my gym wasn't progressing at all and since like a week or three maybe like after i got sick because i wanted to do it in December, but then I got COVID, and then I got sick again, and then I got, I got sick again. <laughs> like, that was just like three weeks on end where I was sick. Um, so like about two, three weeks ago is when I started going back into my routine, going to the gym like five, six days a week, waking up every morning at around 7 a.m. And it is absolutely my vibe, and I'm so much happier. I'm so much better. I'm progressing again, and it just I love it. It's it's my thing, you know? Like, I, I absolutely love going to the gym. And I think that I lost that spark a little bit there because I wasn't as consistent anymore. So every time I went to the gym, everything was hard. And now it's like, no, it's what I'm used to. It's my routine. Um, and yeah, it's hard because I'm pushing myself, but it's not hard in a way where um, you, like, kind of cannot figure out what you're doing. I don't know if y'all get what I'm saying. Uh, spent the whole morning cleaning the house and I'm tired as fuck. Oh my god. Hey, but cleaning days are important though. If I don't have a scheduled cleaning day... Jesus, that, that got me for a second. Maxim, thank you so much for the 100 bits. <laughs> Jesus, good morning to you. Um, resub messages and the actual resubs don't align at all. Oh, gotcha, I see. I clapped up. Good for you, Shade Liquid. Welcome, in. How are you doing this morning? Half... Wait, what is that saying? Half Light? The Spear of the Church, Slave Knight Gale. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. The Hammer Girl. And Meteor. Birch and also the real one. In like three hours. Jesus, that's sick. Good for you, man. 
I mean, Spear of the Church were very easy. But I saw you being Slave Knight Guild. That was, you did great. Good for you. Your routine starts by freezing in your room. That's very true. Welcome in, Slayer. How are you doing today? Didn't hear the sound alert, by the way. Oh, that's true. Y'all didn't. Because I turned it... Because do you hear the... Well, actually, this is quite s serene. The... Um, the Dark Souls music. Now it is. Just a second ago, it was loud as fuck. <laughs> I could hear it though. I just had it muted for stream because it was so loud. No sound for stream. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm good. How about you? I'm doing good too. Happy Friday. Yeah, I am. Um, I'm excited because now we are going to be doing Dark Souls 2. Uh, I don't know what that is going to have in store for us. <laughs> I've never heard that before in my life. What in the cult was that? <laughs> Thank you for the 100 bits. It echoed extra special. I don't understand because the other one you did didn't echo. So I don't understand why this one echoes. It just sometimes it happens. I don't know what it is. Not much of an opponent in hindsight, the Twin Princes were the hardest part of the entire game for me and my baby fireballs. Can't relate, man. Twin Princess was like three tries, Bing I believe. Bye. Bing bang. Oh, that see, and then that one didn't echo. Like, I don't understand. But thank you for the hundred bits again. It was creepy as a fuck. I guess the echoing made it extra creepy, right? Let me Okay. So I know the game. I have I bought the like full DLCs, all DLCs one. Uh we have to make a character. First playthrough, yes, first playthrough, first time, like actually even opening the Oh my god, there's already things happening. Oh shit. A murky forgotten land. Shit, and I also forgot to do the sub thingies. Listen, I was very late. Not now! Maxim! Not now! Listen, I was very late. I, I had lack day and it took a little longer than expected. A place where souls may mend your ailing mind. Me in the future. You will Here we go again. Everything. The symbol of the curse. Also, welcome in Neuros Bracket to see you there for a second. How are you doing today? Darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. Ew, I hate it when they do that. I, I cannot watch. None will have meaning and you won't even care. It wasn't a dead woman, it was a woman with a baby. Other than human. A thing that feeds on souls. A hollow. <laughs> I'm also doing good, thank you for asking. Long ago, in a walled off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it. Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. Ill. She looked at me for a little too long there. And she was like cross-eyed, not like inside, but cross-eyed that way. That was a little spooky. <laughs> oh, wall-eyed? Didn't know that. To be fair, this is the best opening scene from, uh, compared to Dark Souls 3 and Elden Ring. I like this one the most already.
Okay, Dementors, Harry Potter, we're here. Gotcha. Like a moth drawn to a flame. Your wings will burn in anguish. Hanky Potter. Time after Barry time. Potter. But that's a Dutch thing. Barry. Master Movies was my childhood. The fate of the cursed. Yo, Sack, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Don't feel all like a bottom of your oma. <laughs> I can say that during the cutscene. <laughs> Jealous, thank you so much for the follow as well. I really appreciate that. Okay. Oh. Do we not build a character first? <laughs> oh no, no, all the monster movies! No, 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 no. Oh, the more you cost them so little glass. Marcel Operera, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. These are the I I might share it in a second. Okay, so we start here. Okay, okay, okay. Let me try one thing first. Let me turn this off. Let me see if it does let me game capture Dark Souls 2, because it didn't with three. Okay, so Monster Movies is like a parody, and then I also need to do my subs. Listen, like I wait, I will do this full screen. Like I said, I was very late in the gym. I like shoved down my uh, shoved my food down my throat. I'm saying this so wrong, but y'all get what I'm saying. Um, so I I didn't I, I I didn't do these things. But so, um, Master Movies is a parody YouTube. Gee, I I feel that. I feel that. Okay, let me save this. Should be okay. N those aren't steps. Right? If you give me footsteps, I'm gonna hate every single second of it. Uh, throwback to New Year's Eve. Was that on New Year's Eve? Okay, Monster Movies were just, uh, was a parody. I might even like, I can show you like a video of it. They did like, their most popular one was a parody on uh, Baywatch. And, uh, I mean, I can show you, you're not going to understand any of it because it's going to be in Dutch. Um, but Baywatch, they called Zaybots. Uh, and, and, and they, they made videos like this. Born to be a light. And now Bucky Poor. <laughs> it's just... Glow for you, what do you? Now, I have actually no sleep yet, hoor. Krijg nou een bakkie pleur. Je bent toch dat ik niet op Travis Tieten Tieten val? Al. Je hebt lekkere Tieten. Tieten. Meer niet. Meer niet. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I will not show more. I will not show more. Because it's Dutch and only Dutch people understand. And I'm I'm understanding that people that aren't Dutch want to understand what is happening. Uh, it was just very... Uh, a lot of profanity, I think is the word. And uh, a lot of wordplay. This is Golden Peak Comedy. I agree with you. Can I? No, it doesn't let me do that. So if I do this now, will it game capture Dark Souls 2? I'm waiting for the game capture. Doesn't seem like it's game capturing, does it? I'll give it five more seconds. Maybe if I use my controller. Okay, no, it, it doesn't. It, it won't. Which means we'll have to screen capture it again. I'm sorry. It's gonna be a bit of a hassle, but it's okay. As a Belgian Dutch comedy can be amazing. It can be. <laughs> but as a Dutchie, I think Belgium humor is the is like my favorite thing because they're harsh and they can say anything. Where do we go here? What's the plan? Lees toch a book? Do you also know the Harry Potter one where they where they sing on Hallelujah and just they and they just sing like Vanekoeken? That used to be one of my favorites. 
Buddy Poacher. Mm -hmm. I hope the game sounds aren't too loud for you. What do we do here? Do you need to kill these guys? Why do you run away from me? Is this... Do... Do I not? Okay, maybe I don't. Maybe I don't. But then where do I go? The game is really loud for me. I don't know if it's loud for you guys. If it is, let me know. I feel like I saw something yellow on this side earlier. This is how I got here. Yeah, like over there. That's where I need to be, I think. I guess I don't need to kill those people. Mama, I'm welcome in. How are you doing today? My favorite used to be the Star Wars on Lord of the Rings parody. Explore already or do I just follow the path first this looks like the house from the from the intro but is this year at a new workplace oh that sounds like fun what kind of job do you have now oh my your face what about my face, the face of the curse. you're gonna bully me as soon as I step inside I got a pulse, miss. Come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? I don't want to skip this. They are really getting on my nerves. You're finished. You'll go hollow. Yes. You will become a man. I don't think this is in the game. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred bits. Those types of footsteps are okay. <laughs> what do we do? At least they don't have feet like the, like the other old ladies in name? Elden Ring. Oh, now we're going to create a character. Try to recall your name. Melam! With the six month brace of the continued support, I appreciate that so much! Thank you! Wait, wait, I'm cool, I'm cool, I'm cool. Thank you, I really appreciate that! Okay, question. Chat, do we transfer Joker Bird because she's an absolute icon and she deserves everything? Or do we make a new person? Bacall, of course, you think keep Joker Bird? Or do we like find find a, a partner for Joker Bird? Someone that she can maybe like procreate with. And then next game we can make like their kid. Someone not ugly, please? Okay, so Joker Bird. Because Joker Bird is very pretty. This character murdered their wife and children in the opening movie. I wouldn't pin that on Joker Bird. Oh. Oh, wait, the character that we are playing as? We killed our wife and child? I mean, that does sound like Joker Bird jeans. I gotta be real with you. I think so. Oh, that's kind of fucked up, isn't it? If I understood the movie, I guess I didn't. <laughs> to be fair, I was a little distracted. I was whispering with people, so, you know. Okay. So I don't want to pin that on Joker Bird. Should we make, wait, if that is what happens, should we make like an ultimate lefty and then like have a toxicity build? <laughs> should we have like a modern feminist with blue hair and a nose ring? Am I gonna get banned on Twitch for saying that? Um, Should we make a furry? We could also do that because I'm not. 
But like furries would kill their wife and children. What type of people would kill their wife and children? Bad people, but like, which, what type? Undead lose their memories, so the scene could be losing memories and not murder, just speculation. Okay, so I don't want to pin it on Joker Bird. What if we pin it on, uh, let's first don't kill our wife and kid, they don't, oh. I want to make, okay, no, 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 I want to make a whole Joker Bird family, so I think, Maxim, could you please stop sharding? <laughs> not here for me. But thank you for the hundred bits. Uh, just an old white lady woman will probably be fine. Make a white knight. I've seen crime TV. I think we should make a partner for Joker Bird, and then next playthrough we could make like their kid. I think that that would be fun. So. This is going to be, what is their name going to be? What would Joker Bird's husband, because they need to make babies, unless they adopt. I guess they're birds, so like, you do need to have the opposite sex, because they need to like, hatch it. So Joker Bird's husband, what would his name be? Husbando Crow. <laughs> we definitely need something related to birds. How much white knighting does the husband do? A lot. I mean, you do need to get Joker Bird on your side. And focus on work now. Have a good rest of the stream and obviously have an amazing weekend, everyone. Thank you so much, Maxim. I really appreciate that. I hope you have a lovely weekend to yourself, too. And also, thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate that as well. Okay, let's see if we can find something. Can we get, like, bird, bird names? But, like... Bur bird nicknames. I know enough about how birds made to be upset about the implication of Joker Bird's quokka. I, I don't know what that is. Okay, I just saw something that said Mr. Beaks, and I really like that. <laughs> I don't know where I found it, though. Yeah, Mr. Beaks. <laughs> That's kind of cute. <laughs> Right? I like that. Crow bro is also a good one. Crow bro, I mean, I'm sorry, but I don't think I can... Uh, I have a good way of pronouncing it. It's a fazino... I, I know. I know. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna look at that shit. We got... We got the whole Donald Duck squad. Of course, of course. Uh, what's this? Bird Pokemon names? The ho <laughs> Um, I don't know shit about Pokemon, okay? I don't think I should have Pokemon name. You can always call them Jim Bro, that's true. But then I would say Jim Crow. I think we settled on Mr. Beaks. I kind of really liked Mr. Beaks. Funny bird name, Chick Jagger. Jack Sparrow. <laughs> oh no, we've, we've got... <laughs> Lady Bird? I mean, we already have Joker Bird. Larry Bird? Marty McFly? What is this? Meryl Cheap? Not Meryl Cheap! Don't give me Meryl Cheap! I don't like it. Stephen Quack Squawking? Really? Stephen Squawk? <laughs> What happened here? Uh, um. <laughs> Does anyone have a favorite? Wingman actually is a good one. I agree. She's dying laughing. Uh huh. Bird names. <laughs> Beak comedy. True. Beak comedy. Squeak comedy. <sighs> I don't know if you want, if I want what? Clearly will suffer, you died without even playing. Th that's true. Call the police on you. I like Peeps, personally. I don't think Peeps is a, is a... I think Peeps sounds too soft for a Joker Bird husband. I think Joker Bird really needs like a... Like a big bird next to her. And Peeps sounds cute. That could be a child. 
You could call it after the bird from, from Dark Souls 3, maybe? Is there a bird in Dark Souls 3? Beak comment. <laughs> I do not have a quote. We do not need to add that to quotes. Let's see weird bird names. Oh, they're not weird at all. I mean, flossy, Nutella. Like, what does that have to do with birds? But you're saying that there was a bird? They're called Pickle Pea and Pumperum? Nah. Okay, okay. So, um, my... My... You know what? We could get Mr. Beaks, but then that he, he still has a middle name. We could... Well, no, we cannot do that. I like Stephen Squawking. I like Jack Sparrow. And I like Mr. Beaks. Let's have a poll. Where do I get a poll in here? Um, why did I know how to do this and now I cannot find it anymore? Where's my poll? Where do I give polls? Am I blind? Wait, where do I add a poll? Yeah, I'll just... if I So if I do this, then it will open a poll? Or do I then have to put it in? No, it will. Okay. Character. Wait, wait. Joker... Joker Bird's... Ooh, Joker Bird's husband name. Slayer? What the gift of something jealous? I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. That, that's so sweet of you. Thank you. Mwah. I appreciate that. We got Mr. Beaks. We got Jack Sparrow. And we got Stephen Squee. How is that spelled? Stephen Squawking. There we go. I want to know what y'all think. <laughs> Happy Friday for sure. <laughs> it makes me so happy. I don't know why. Let's just keep Googling funny bird names while y'all are voting because I think we realize this is my kind of humor, isn't it? Why does that not work? Is it because this stupid thing came up? Give me funny bird names. Are you going to play the OG Dark Souls 2 or Scholar of the First Sin? I have the like full... It's Scholar of the First Sin. Is that not the OG? I thought that Scholar of the First Sin was just the full, like, all DLCs. Isn't that it? Do I have the wrong one? Scholar is fine. I think Scholar is a better choice, even not, even if not OG. Different mob places. Oh. I'm sorry. I didn't know that. I thought that it meant... Huh. Well, I hope it didn't fuck up. I hope we can still, like, play normally. I was wrong about the bird's name. It's called Snuggly the Crow. Ugh, I do not want to snuggle up to a crow. I gotta be real with you. Skola also has updated Direct X and looks better. Okay, so it is better. How it's supposed to be. Okay, okay, so then that's a good thing. Would you be able to play normally? I don't know. Okay, it seems like Stephen Squawking is winning. <laughs> Which I do like because um, the movie about Stephen Hawking's it, it's just Hawking, right? Is one of my favorite movies ever. Uh, the Theory of Everything. I absolutely love that movie. It's so beautiful. I always cry like a little bitch. B little baby. Little baby, I'm... Listen. I, it's okay. Can I, can I like copy paste? No, I cannot. Stephen. It's with an A, isn't it? It is. Stephen Squawking. It doesn't fit. What if we do Mr. Squaw Squawking? But then we could better do Mr. Beaks. But that had, had the least amount of... Okay, what about Jack Sparrow? Maybe I should have checked this first. Jack Spar Sparrow. That does fit. Sparrow, double R. Stephen Beaks isn't as funny, is it? B 
Because the fun part about Stephen squawking is that it comes from Stephen Hawking. More enemies that don't need to be there. Just made the OG game worse. Oh no. But a hawk is a bird. What if we... It, would that fit? Stephen Hawking. That also doesn't fit. But what if we... What if we made it? Um... Hmm. Dude, it's already a bird pun, kinda. Why bird names? Okay, because our previous build that we did, uh, Elden Ring was uh, uh, in Dark Souls. I didn't do it in Elden Ring because that was the first time I played the game. And then I got Dark Souls 3 and we made a character and we named her Joker Bird because that's exactly what she looked like. She looked like a, a bird, but like as the Joker. And now we're trying to make our husband so that in the next games we can make their children. Um, the Bull Gravano. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. Welcome on in. Mr. Beaks fit though. That does fit. Cut down letters. Steven. Good one. Steven. Squawk. Kit. That fits. His parents knew what they were doing. <laughs> We could do Steven squawking like that. Ellen is trying to move on from furries to feathers. I've always been very afraid of birds. I gotta be real with you. Gonna take longer than the dancer fight. That's okay. That's what it's for, isn't it? Oh, I think we're landing on Steven squawking like this. Also, I gotta do a gigabyte check. Um, For everyone that's wondering why I'm on my phone, unlimited data does not exist. And you'll get a cap that you'll need to refill uh, every so often. Because I'm already through everything. Gigabyte chat. <laughs> a little bit. I can only add two gigabytes at a time. And that's absolute bullshit. Does it? Can I? Okay. Yes. Steven squawking. You're streaming on mobile data? I am. Yes. Why is it... Gotcha. <laughs> Felder, welcome in. How are you doing? <laughs> Don't give me that Slayer stuff. <laughs> it's a human effigy. <laughs> Take a closer look. Who do you think it's supposed to be? Looks like that onion guy. Think back deep into your past. Yes, it's an effigy of you. <laughs> okay, okay, now we're gonna make ourselves. Uh, but I will come back to the question of why I'm streaming on mobile data. Data. I don't know if you're Dutch, but here in the Netherlands we have a living situation that's called. Anti crack, more like anti squat. And when the government doesn't know what to do with the building, you can live in it for less amount of money. And um, you'll just have to make sure that nothing breaks or whatever. But that means that I don't have internet and I have to stream from mobile data. Oh my. Is the stream down? No, it isn't. It was on zero for a second. But I don't think we crashed, did we? Can I get an update? Did we crash? Let me check the internet because I'm pretty sure I did add more. We did crash. Okay, shit. Fuck. I... But I... <sighs> I guess the internet is not the only reason that I sometimes crash. I did add more internet, so it's weird. Is the whole internet just that? No, it should be back just isn't back on my side let me add i can't because i already did but like it doesn't want to reload on my end i know it says that i'm live okay i think now i'm back i'm like full-on crash shit i'm sorry can we get a exclamation mark crash in the chat 
It happens. Refresh, Rebecca Twitch did a derp yesterday. Ah, it might just be on my end though. You're back? Okay, I'm fully back. Okay, lovely. Uh, yeah, it does say that I did add the internet, so I don't understand what happened, but okay. We'll, we'll live with it. Ooh, don't do that. Okay. We were going over what class? Oh, I'm alive. Hell yeah! Welcome in, Lips. How are you doing today? Okay, so I was thinking swordsman with gr who fights gracefully. That's kind of sick. I like that. A bandit, an outlaw. But Joker Bird with an outlaw, though. That does seem very iconic. Love to have a pizza from yesterday. Living the dream, man. High faith and miracles guide the way. Knowledgeable sorcerer, cast sorcery with high intelligence and attunement. Well-traveled explorer, not terribly powerful, but has many items. Deprived. <laughs> Unclothed. Origin unknown. Has nothing to fight with except life-affirming flesh. Ooh, hey you, you're finally awake. You were trying to cross the border, right? Walk right into the Imperial ambush, same as us. And that thief over there. Is that the opening? Food content? Bird talent content? No, 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 no. No, I'm not going deprived. I'm not going deprived because I'm too bad of a gamer to go deprived. A monster, they think he's so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. Welcome on in. She never played Sky. Oh, it's a Skyrim thing? Listen, I haven't played video games in my life. Elden Ring was my first video game ever, and that was uh, April this year. So, who needs pants? Anyone? Well, I can still take off pants. Okay, I think that Bandit or Swordsman is the best to go as Joker Bird's husband. What do you guys think? Between Swordsman and Bandit, what do you think we should go? Playing the Soul Series is part of becoming the good gamer. I am already the upper ego gamer girl, ooh woo. Ooh woo. So, you know, last year, surely. Oh, that's true. Last year's April, because this year's April hasn't started yet, has it? Jack the Cat, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in, how are you doing today? You would like Skyrim, but it's possible. A bandit. Did you finish Elden Ring as a mage? I haven't finished it yet as a melee. I think we should go with the bandit. He's also fast, right? Because it says um, dexterity. High dexterity, so we can go shing shing again. Has power stance, dual wielding. Dual wielding. Gonna do dexterity or strength or something else. Ooh. I. You know what? No, 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 no. We're going like full story mode here. So I think that going bandit is the best thing for Joker, but he's also skilled with a bow. So maybe he like tried to catch Joker Bird with the bow and then Joker Bird was like, Bagah! you can catch me like that. And then he was like, oh my God, this is just strong, powerful woman. And then Joker Bird was like, Bagah! you, you are, you are thick. And I like that. And then he was like, ah, oh, you have such a beautiful nose. Would you marry me? And then that's where it started, you know? Um, yo, Kubana so thank you so much for the prime. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mwah. That's very sweet of you. Story time with Ellen a little bit. Uh, she has to use power stancing in this game. Why do I have to? It's a law. Only Elden Ring and Dark Souls 2 have power stancing in a soul series. You can always mix in some faith and dex later on if you want. But what is power stancing? You got it for the accent. <laughs> what do you mean? I don't have an accent. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm not like European or whatever. I'm not Dutch. I don't get what you're saying. I've only been here for 30 seconds and I can already tell you my kind of people. Ron and Kaylee, that's very sweet of you. Thank you so much. Wait, I'm cool. I'm cool. Thank you so much. Faith builds her park. I don't have that much faith, to be honest. Ron and Kaylee, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Oh. Kubana, so are you telling me you did hit the pride but not the follow? <laughs> Thank you for the follow as well. <laughs> Tea time first. I'm Dark Souls 2. This will be good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Cyrus, police are we building? We are building Joker Bird's husband. Is fighting with two weapons. Oh, that's sick. Dueling, but it's Dark Souls 2. It's called power stancing. You need to have 
when I have requirements to efficiently power stands. But when I, okay, but could you explain to me? Because in Dark Souls 3, I had the uh, um, twin swords, twin blades, and that was two weapons as well. So what's the difference between power stancing and just having two weapons? Because I fought with two weapons. It was one, it was two. Twin swords were two blades. Laser Mink, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. I have to leave for an hour or so. Catch you later, squeakings. Catch you later. Have a great day. You do have a unique move set. I have the requirements of the highest weapon. Twin swords are the scuffed way Dark Souls 3 try to make power stancing. You can do it with any weapon combination of the specific ones. Okay. Twin swords is one same weapon. Okay, gotcha. So it's like you have two completely different ones. So be having each sword as individual. Yeah, exactly. They were like a pair. Okay, so... So y'all are saying I should go for a swordsman. So Joker Bird didn't fall for a bandit. Joker Bird saw this man and he was so gracefully fighting with strong weapons in both hands and joker bird was like he is so graceful and he uses both hands this is exactly what i need so she like um flew even more gracefully to like get his attention and he was like oh my that's the most beautiful bird i've ever seen and and then and then she like landed next to him and she was like you are so graceful and so am i and then he was like wow that's a woman with confidence maybe she should be with me and then he asked her to go out for to to maybe catch a movie sometime and she was like let's do that and then <laughs> and <laughs> And then they went to the Joker, of course, and um, and and then and then um, Stephen Stephen Squawking said like, "Wow, you you kind of look like the Joker, though." And then and then Joker Bird was like, "I do. That's where I got my name from." And then he's like, "Wow, that's so impressive. You are a superstar. I want to marry you right now." And and then and then they did. But this is before that. This is before he. You know what? No, 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 no! Oh my God! Storytelling. So Stephen Squawking is like, okay, I need to marry Joker Bird, but she's so amazing and grateful, not grateful, graceful, and and she has already accomplished so many things because she fully finished Dark Souls Three. She killed so many people. And then, so now he's like, shit, I need to be on her level, man. I cannot ask her to marry me if if I'm not as great as her. So he is like, let's go do the, oh, not the bandit, the swordsman. So he is like, we need to finish this game so that we can ask Joker Bird to marry us. And then the story is a full circle and we, can, we have come to the end now. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. Let's see, what did I, what did I miss in chat? Got to your storytelling, you're welcome. Uh, my dad did come over yesterday and he said to me, when I did my musical in the last year of elementary school, that uh, everyone was impressed with my acting skills and the fact that I could just stand there on the stage uh, without any nerves. So I guess it's where, you know, I guess you're right. I do have got to your storytelling. Thank you, I appreciate that. Birds are huge on this stream. This is <laughs> it just like accidentally happened. Isn't that Stephen bacawing? No, it's 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 a Stephen squeaking, squawking, squawking. Ellen famously loves birds. They are. It's not true. Some people use bits to play birds. <laughs> Ellis Hightower, welcome in. How are you doing today? Now we are having character development. You always have character development in my stream. Like, when I played Elden Ring, my first video game ever, by the way, I made a whole story about this girl who had, like, black eyes, and she was, like, fully possessed, and, um, and she needed to, like, fight everyone to get her redemption, and then I looked up names that would, that would fit that, and then in Greek mythology, 
you had these ladies that were called Caress, and they would like suck out the demons from uh, men that died on the battlefield. Like, I fully had a background story for that girl. Have you thought about using notifications on your Discord, like when you go live or such? I have thought about that, and I don't want to do that. Because I personally hate it whenever I get messages of like, I'm going live now! And I hate it so much that I've left Discords because of it. Like, I have muted every single Discord, but some do that so often. You get still so many messages that I'm like, ugh, I don't, I get so annoyed by it. So that's why I don't want to do it. I do put it on Instagram every day, though. Every time I go live. Next week I have another job interview? That's cool for the job you want. Good luck on that. You're gonna kill it. I believe. Gotta kneel down to the teeth. Hell yeah. Okay, so we're going for a swordsman. What's our gift? Nothing. I'm not on Insta, so oh gotcha. This ring of old slightly increases HP. A familiar looking F F I F I have no clue how you pronounce that. Returns the hollow to life. That sounds sick. Various items used to cure poison poison and restore HP essentially for anyone traveling drang shit. She did say how to pronounce this, and I thought to myself, I need to remember. Dranglick? Zarxel 3 Ember Effigy. Okay, effigy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. A homeward bone, we know what that is. Seed of a tree of giants. A seed grown from a tree of giants. Inedible. Okay, so are you gonna explain to me what it does or not? Toss into a bonfire to erase the strength of nearby foes only for those who seek greater challenges. <laughs> not me! Petrified something. A simple petrified lump, it may be of some use someday. So we're going for the human effigy, right? That's the one that makes the most sense. It's a place you're playing, like Lothric in Dark Souls 3. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It said that in the opening scene, in the cutscene. Um, or a life ring. It, listen, it, I, I would say it does kind of fit the lore if he's wearing a ring. Because he wants to ask Jokobur to marry him. But it also makes sense to have this because this just seems like the one that's, you know. Bonfire Ascetic. As I think I said that right. Can get really important later on depending what you want to do. But for starting gift, I think it's really not that good. E. Petrified something is what I went for last time I played Dark Souls 2. But it's your choice. You can collect all of these in the game. But it doesn't explain to me what it is. Right? Or this one does. Yeah, it doesn't explain what to do with it. Probably if you die, you lose it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. This is like something that's long lasting. You know, it makes a lot of sense. It even kind of looks like a heart on the ring. So I think we would do this. Because lore. You have to reverse hollowing in this game. Okay. Now, how do I do the rest of my body? Because this is like the whole end. I don't want to do that. How do I go to... Why can I not go to body? How do I do that? Do I just... Oh, I have to do that with my mouse? Because I couldn't do it with my... Uh, controller. Gender. Yes, we are male. Uh, uh, <laughs> we are built thick. From all that I could see from that little thingy. Uh, but we are going to be strong though. Is that the only thing I can do? I cannot do anything advanced? Face. Maybe I should just do this with, uh, with my map. He is very ugly. Oh, that's not making it better, is it? Uh... This kind of looks like Joker Bird. That nose? Like, we can do a lot with that. Honestly, that hair looks good. I was not expecting to have good looking hair in this game. Can you give me some hair? He looks so sad because he is sad because he doesn't have Joker Bird yet. It looks like he's in a frat. He kind of does, doesn't he? Oh, you can just like scroll over it. 
Okay, let's be real. Joker Bird would, would fall for that little, like, hair streak. That is what he gets Joker Bird with. Now, if we would go full lefty, this is what this would be the thing to do. But we're not. Um, we're trying to catch Joker Bird's attention. Ooh, that's ugly. Um, I think I like black hair the most. Eyebrows. I mean, we do need thick and bushy eyebrows, don't we? We can black as well. It is, you know, they are going to get with Joker Bird. I think blue eyes is pretty. I like that. Where's the nose, though? Where can I do anything about the nose? Is that not an option? Beard? If you don't have a beard, do not talk to me. <laughs> it's not even an option if you don't have a beard. Can do anything advanced? Also casually hovers her mouse over the tab that says advanced. Okay, so that's for later on, I guess. A tattoo. Is there a bird? Can we put a bird on us? This is a bird. I don't know where it's on, but that was a bird. And we need it. Because it's a bird with a heart. Oh, it's on the face? That's kind of sick. Thank God I have a full beard. <laughs> it's just, you know, the way it is for me. Can we also put that in another place than, than the face? Or is that in advanced settings? Oh! And then I could also put the tattoo somewhere else. Okay, 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 okay. Get me the tattoo. I do want that. But like, position one? It doesn't tell me where it's at. Uh, I guess you can only have it on the face. What if we get it over the nose? Ah, that doesn't work. That's too bad. Okay, well, I guess in that face, in that case, it needs to be on the face, right? Because this one is probably, yeah, going to be the height. It does need to be like, fully visible angle i don't want to do that actually the size bigger we can't do that we can't that was kind of sick i liked it like that okay we can keep that uh we are in advanced still let's do the nose first because we all know that that is very important i cannot switch the character around the color? I don't really care about the color. What is this? What's the difference? I don't see it. The nose rich? Concave or convex? What? What is that? What does it do? It doesn't explain anything to me. Can I... Can this character... Oh, it can move. Oh, lovely. No, the bigger the better. I guess. Yes, the bigger the better. Because that is what bonds them. It do be Steven squawking, okay? Nice. The bigger the better. When they say size doesn't matter, it does. Size matters. And this is this is exactly what I mean with that. It's spooky, but it's okay. I it's it's on the right. That's okay. What's this? Oh, that makes it very weird. No, as far down as you can. Nostril size? Give it give it a large. Yeah. Seems right. Seems right. Definitely. Okay, now mouth. I think we only need to change his eyes and then I'm already happy. Where is eyes? Eyes. What the fuck is that? A glabella deaf? What is that? I've never heard of that. Is that my English lacking? I guess I like it more that way. Is this a sideways thing? 
It is. Sure. All right, positioning. Sure. Maybe we need to change something about the eyebrows. He seems so sad. I don't want him to look sad. Ooh, that's spooky. Sure. I right, angle. Is that how we make it? Okay, that already lo that already looks less less sad. Uh, I guess I was fine the way it was. The color is pretty. I like blue eyes. What about this? I socket. I don't feel like this is any brighter than this is. It's just in a different spot. Right. Ooh. That is some wrong concealer. Starting to look more and more like Mr. Beaks. No, 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 no. This is Stephen Squawking. He does need to be pretty. Eyelids? Yeah, you're just making the game very spooky by doing that. Eyelid color? Are we doing makeup now? What's going on? I don't get these settings. Eyeliner? That's actually kind of hot. I'm gonna keep it. I don't need to have eyeshadow on you. Um, hormones? Make him as masculine as he can be. He's going to be with Joker Bird. He needs it. He also needs to have a... He does need to have a weak emphasis, but that is a little bit spooky. I mean, he needs a strong one. You're gonna be with Joker Bird. You need everything to be strong. Oh, I hate that. I'm not gonna do that. Uh, H? I don't understand the difference between these ages. Do you get more yellow when you age? Like, what is going on here? Age was fine. I'm okay with that. Uh, what's this? Cheek color laugh lines? I don't care about these things. Where, where can I fix the eyebrows? Oh, it's here. Like the... Is it the inner brow? Ooh, that's spooky. We need to make him look less, less sad. Because he looks very sad. That's not the plan here. Maybe a bit high. I don't think we can fix it, actually. This kind of helps. Ooh, that's spooky. Okay, we definitely need the bushy eyebrows. He looks less sad. I feel like he does. We already fixed the tattoo. We got the beard. I don't understand why this is in advance when it's also just in normal. No, give, give me the long beard. Okay. I think we got it. Um, now Wafiti. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. It looks like Sinbad. It shows we're wrong. <laughs> I don't like that he's a little mopey. But he does seem like he is the perfect match for Joker Bird. The bigger the better I hear it here first. Is a part between the eyebrows. Oh, what a weird name. Starting to look more and more like Mr. P. It's okay. Ipsuhi, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. Welcome on in. I think we're done. I think we're like fully done. Finish creating. Oh shit. I have a Xbox controller. Oh, the finished creation. Is it the like three lines? Is it the middle one or is it the two screens? Perfecto, thank you. Cursed content, it's not. It's romance. Back to class and gift. Oh, finalized creation. Is this your true self? It indeed is. All people come we can't go here back now. The same reason to break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Hmm. 
doesn't stand a chance. Shut the fuck up. I'll prove you wrong. You never know. Exactly. <laughs> the one with the most bird-like nose said, you'll never know. She got my back. She understands. Go through the way the of the birds. And trot along to the kingdom. But remember, hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going hollow. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. <laughs> now, don't laugh with that tongue in my face. I love this game. We're here. We just finished character creation. Like this on Xbox 360. Damn. And hello, new viewer. Welcome in, Underhill. How are you doing today? Uh, is this the lady that's going to get my runes and all? Drank Lake. Fair traveler. I know that you must have a story. Yeah, trying to marry Joker Bird. Why else would you visit such a place? This lost, decayed kingdom. My name is Millibeth. I'm sorry. <laughs> That's not a name you want to have. Millibeth? Jesus. You're Dutch, nice. My wife is Dutch, and I'm from the USA. Oh, nice! And her mother before her. And so do, do you live in the Netherlands, or did she move to the USA for you? The old women were keepers of the fire. But now, the fire shows signs of fading. And the kingdom is beset by hollows. Her whole family! Jeez, good for you, man! The old women are sisters. I am told there was a fourth. Are you the fourth? Long ago, fire keepers were commonplace. But now they are lost, scattered to the winds. The yeah. old women are sisters. Okay, ago, yeah. But now they are lost. So is this like the firelink shrine for this game? Do I go upstairs? Chest? Is it going to attack me? No. Listen, I've seen mimic chests, okay? Pick up item. A human effigy. Did I get it? Okay. I gotta tell you, these tutorial areas become easier the more from soft games that I've played. <laughs> Which makes total sense. Do we get through this way? No. I think we need to go through this one. Did I go to the wrong one? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. Did I? Yes, I did. It's okay. It, ha it happens. It happens. Destroy chests in this game, which also destroys the item. Oh. Oh, gotcha. Thank you. I appreciate that. There's a bonfire! Party is lit, boys! I hate myself for doing that. There's an item. Both lost undead and a torch. Oh my. What is this? Can I read it? Looks like a gravestone. Bonfires are places of... Oh, yeah, you don't have to... You may also light torches on them. Oh, okay. Equipment? Is there a torch in here? Where did my torch go? Wait, where's my torch? Waligi deserves his own game. I like that name. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. I like you because you did say that. <laughs> If I toggle... Light torch! So you can only light them if they are in a bonfire? That's a... Uh, ooh, yikes. Rickball, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. Why is there a timer? Is that a timer for my bonfire? 
Enter the mist. Uh oh, enemies. I just gotta fight these guys, right? Nice. Okay. Any more? Do I need to read these things or are these hold? What do you mean? What do you mean? That doesn't work at all. What are you talking about? Or like, oh, if you do it as you're running. Time for the tour. Yeah, that's what I figured. But thank you for confirming. Oh, there's a guy. Don't hit me like that, dude. Can I also like one? Oh, I can. But then you can't see shit. Oh, and now my torch is out, isn't it? See, I messed up. But I think it's okay. I don't think it matters that much. What's that? What is that? What was that? Okay, I guess I'm just a little bit fucked because I don't have my torch anymore. There's a dagger. That's a sick move. Oh, I like that. Joker Bird kind of has the same move, doesn't she? I don't know where they're at because I can't see anymore. I did accidentally unequip my torch. Okay, I cannot jump on it. Is that what I have to follow? Seems like it is. Well, back step. You think I'm stepping back at any point? I'm not. Right, sir, Doc. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. Oh, that was way easier than I expected. Items, a life gem, lovely. Okay, are life gems the same as potions? Also, I gotta check my internet, not because I'm just like chilling on my phone, but because unlimited data does not exist and you'll have to manually add data at a time. Good for you for calling it out because I had to get more are extra potions okay but it's not like an ember same odd movements same odd movements with the way the movement and the camera works compared to other dark souls yeah that's what i was expecting my brain is still melted how's it still melted torch yeah i've played dark Souls recently again i'm stoked to see you play it i'm glad to hear that I think it had to hold the button for two-handing and other... Yeah, like the Y. That's how you two-hand something. Oh, I like that. This is how he gets the moves on Joker Bird for sure. He did that to Joker Bird and she was like, oh my. <laughs> oh my, I need to get to notice, man. You have an Estus? Not in here. Oh, there's a ladder. This can't be reality. Give us more. Yes, you. Give us Suki. Give us Silky? Okay, but if this is not Joker Bird confirmed, if these are not meant to be, I don't know what is. What is Silky? Where do I have Silky? Can I find Silky? You haven't met him in Dark Souls 3, did you? Who? What is Silky and how do I give it? it? Was an item you could give them? Oh, I guess I don't have it. I'm sorry. Can I not go down the ladder? Him, the bird, like my character, Steven Squawking. Oh, not while you're in the menu. I see. I can only kick it down, but I want to use it. Climb down. But it was already down. What do you mean, kick it down? If you torch burnt their nest, 
down. Oh my god, I would have cried. Like, for real, for real, on god, on god, I would have cried. Oh. Excuse me, man. That you box your way. Oh, because I really cannot walk past it. Gotcha. Makes sense. Something is walking towards me. Maybe it isn't. Maybe it's just the echoing of my own footsteps. It was halfway down? Oh, I didn't see that. I mean, we could have probably jumped halfway down, but it's okay. If you want to kick, I get it. Some of us have anger management issues. And some of us has, have had them since they were a child and their parents need to put them on a underneath a cold shower to calm down, you know? I guess this is not the tutorial area anymore, which means we have to go back because we do want to see everything of the game. Because there was another spot that I could go to that I have now missed. Majula Satch? Oh no, why? Things be wixed. I like that name though. It reminds me of Wings Club. I could also go here. What controller is that? Uh, Xbox. A cheapo Xbox controller because I do not have money <laughs> to invest in anything better. It's not even a real Xbox One. I think it's like Power A. Okay, I guess that's fine. Examine? What do I need to examine here? While dashing, jump that. Press that to jump. <coughs> Got it. Don't fall off, please. I'm begging. Ugh. Okay. I guess it's just full on tutorial, isn't it? Wayne, welcome in. How are you doing today? Reminds me of Tilks. What's that? Xbox has best design. Um, I feel like I have pulled a PlayStation one and they seem to be very wide, whereas I have tiny hands, so they are always too wide for me. Can I fight that guy? Or I guess if you wanted to fight that guy, you needed to do something specific for this guy to go away right that's what i'm guessing it's like an optional thing if you pick the right item fix of chocolate sorry i just woke up gotcha i think twitch twix the chocolate is the most overrated candy bar i've ever seen be consumable for it gotcha the asymmetrical sticks of the xbox instead of the bottom ones I don't even remember how the PlayStation 1 felt like. I think I used it like once. I always felt like I was holding two potatoes, but it was more ergonomic. Is that how you say it in English? In the PlayStation 1? Yeah, I like these. Lint chocolate game. Lint is the coat. Let me tell you a fun story about Lint. Last year, I was still working in a clothing shop in like this mall area. And it was around Christmas time. And these ladies who were promoting Lint came to our store. And they were like, yo, we got a full box left over. Do you want some Lint chocolate? And I was like, yeah. So she had this whole box. I think there were like maybe even more than a hundred of those lint um the red balls in there oh my god not orange don't give me orange and chocolate i hate that yes please lint is good hell yeah no but i think i'm going to be sticking with the xbox controllers because i like them the most i think hello thought we got a thoughtful bird Welcome in and how are you doing today? We might have a thing for birds in here. Um, uh, Lothbrook, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. You know, I created a character in Dark Souls 3 and her name was Joker Bird. And now we are making our husband, um, who is Steven Squeaking? Squawking? Steven Squawking. Um, so uh, you you'll fit right in. Despite your blasphemy for Lind Orange, I... It's kind of the same as, like, um, chocolate and mint. I can't stand it. It's disgusting, in my opinion. 
In my humble opinion. I thought it tastes good with chocolate. I do love oranges, though. Oranges are goaded. What are we doing here? Where are we going? What's the plan? Garden Crown, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. Welcome on in. Chocolate with a mint is fucking gross. It is, isn't it? Chocolate and salt, though. Sometimes... Like, salted caramel is okay. Have you business with me? The way your underwear's all blocked up, you see, by this god awful statue. Heavens above. Mint chocolate is goaded. Oh, that it stop there. that. Oh, I'm in quite the pickle now. Monk burps. <laughs> Can we talk further? Ooh. See that statue? Gives me the willies. You stare at it for long enough, it starts to look alive. Ach, it just doesn't he seem quite right. No, so I agree with Lothric. I backs. agree. Even though I'm allergic to two out I of those really three things, I agree. Mr. I wasn't allergic all my life for it, so I agree with him. See that statue? Gives me the willies. Life. Just doesn't he seem quite right? Hey, you don't. I don't know what statue you're talking about because it seems like it's torn down. Gotcha. Horse. Ooh, they're gonna attack me. Ooh. That's a skeleton with a poison skeleton weapon. Why is this weapon also a skeleton? That's messed up. And he got big balls. Them nuts though. Ooh, I'm almost dead. How do I get a life back? Did you see them nuts? I'm allergic to strawberries too if I eat when I die. I won't die, but it's not good. Is it safe now? Is it weird that I almost died to him? Or is that something that happens to many people? Well, have you eat the weirdest things, I swear? What do you mean, fitness people? I am fitness people! Is that you blocks your way? Don't give me that sound. It sounded like the girl from, from the grudge. Don't give me that. So I cannot go through this, I guess. Feel attacked. Say, man. You are telling me you never had cottage cheese with honey? <gasps> cottage cheese with clementines. Cottage cheese with clementines are absolutely goaded. I love that. I was AWE attacking everyone. <laughs> oh, gotcha. This looks like Darth Maul. Part. Cottage cheese and red bell pepper is good to say, but then you do need to add some salt and pepper. Otherwise, it's disgusting. But with but with salt and pepper, it's goaded. Normal cheese and burgers are goaded. I like that too. Sour with all salt and pepper. Eve. But I cannot eat cottage cheese anymore because turns out I am allergic to milk, I think? And it all kind of just tastes like vomit to me. Oh, there's a bonfire here. Ew, yeah, a little ew. Ooh, it's pretty. <gasps> I like that. A Nitrami. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Ironic that the best cheese for burgers is that American processed cheese. You think that's the best one? I don't agree with you. Give us smooth. What is smooth? And I understand Moin. Is Moin from um, that one movie 
with with all the the seagulls that and and then they're all like moin 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 or is that something else is that oh moin is from germany oh gotcha then i guess i don't know Th that's what i was thinking of the movie with the seagulls Yes, give us some fuel with the sun. Where's the sun? Where's the sun? Where's the sun? Let me go to there. Let me, let me. You give us silky. I don't know what silky is. Oh, it's so pretty. I like it. Make this more movie about fish. Oh, is it from Finding Nemo? It might be actually. My Erasmus time in Germany. Why? What if, what if we go up here for the sun view? Don't attack me. I'm here. I'm just here for the view, sir. <gasps> oh my god. He's just standing out here thinking about Joker Bird. And, and thinking about the future that's ahead of them. Let's just enjoy this for a second. Praise the ocean. Hell yeah! I'm impressed with these water graphics, for sure. 20 FPS or is it just my stream? No, it's a little struggling at the moment. I'll check the internet. I don't think it's that though, because I just added internet. Yeah. It's not the internet, it's just my something something on my end you know it is mobile data at the end of the day isn't it it will it will get better soon don't worry about it we'll get there you're undead aren't you you have that distinct scent the smell of irreversible fate this is majula it is a kind of settlement. A place where life is almost normal. <laughs> Hamsters are taking I've been trying to make these days. There are places like Don't that. Say that. <laughs> Don't say that. Don't say that. No animal cruelty here. I am <laughs> Solden. And like you, I lost everything. And now I'm here. You probably heard that it was possible to break the curse here. Well, that's not true at all. There's nothing here for you, me, or anybody. Only the path of glory, my man! Do you know much about sun? Stop moping! Look up the at the sky! Is... Praise the goddamn sun, dude! What is this pessimistic bullshit? Anything living, sentient or no, supposedly has one. So I move for a while. Thank you. I appreciate that, Dawkins. Is traceable to the soul. Do you see what that means? To be alive, to walk this earth. That's the real curse. It's not. Life is beautiful. You have to make it beautiful, Undead though. Undead will never die. And that's quite a predicament, really. This guy is so fucking pessimistic. Stop that, sir. There are four beings in this land with giant souls. And He's really he going through it. He needs to gym for sure. Sooner or later, come up against them. He will be scary in the gym. He'll get really strong. Soul. And a terrible curse. If that frightens you, then you ought to just give up right now. Huh. Like I have. See, you're just a pussy. You've given up because you're frightened. Where there is fear, there is growth. This is like the truest advice I can give you guys. I had a... um. I had an anxiety disorder, like a severe anxiety disorder for about seven years of my life. The reason that I got through it 
is because every time I got scared, I said to myself, where there's fear, there is growth. So if you are stuck in something, if you feel like you cannot go through or like everything is a little too much for you, just remember where there's fear, there's growth. My man, he needs to learn that where there's fear, there's growth. <laughs> Do you ever cry out for help? My man is me in the club. I never go to the club, the I can't relate. Undead is long and treacherous. You'll face invaders from other worlds at every turn. If you need help, why not proclaim faith in the blue sentinels? When you face danger, the blue sentinels will come to your aid. Protection is yours, if you wish. You need only accept their kind embrace. That's actually how fear works. If you are scared and you're going to fight against your anxiety, it's only going to get worse. But if you feel anxiety and you embrace it, you accept that you're anxious, it actually goes away. Or it like stays at the same level. It's manageable. I use that in the future. Like you kind of should. Even with like sad emotions, you just need to embrace it. The more you run away from it, the worse it's going to get. Just embrace it. Just feel for a second. That is a wise decision. People are weak. We'll get all spheres after that. Watch over us in their benevolence. Let on a growth the back there. Stop it, Slayer. Embrace. Do you feel it? lonely? It suits me just fine. As I've nothing left. Anyway. Oh my, he really is going through it, man. This place. Give it some time. Has it grown on you, sir? You seem miserable. Wait, oh, enter the covenant? We already do that. Learn a gesture. Welcome. Thank you. I wish he was just as, just as excited as that welcoming thing. Do you thing. see the way beyond the bonfire? That will take you to the forest of the giants. There was once a great fort, but little of it remains. You may just find something there that will be of use on your journey. But don't venture too far inside, or you might not come back. Okay, well, I don't... I gotta be real with you. I don't want to talk to this guy anymore because he's absolutely depressing. And he's, like, accepting his... his depression. Listen, it is okay to feel sad every once in a while. It's okay to not always feel happy and to feel anxious sometimes and to feel like you're really going through it. But feel it, live it, and then... Breathe in, breathe out, move on. Make make sure that everyone, everything around you is in a way where it balances out and where you can move on. Make sure that every day you make the most of it and make sure that every day you are focused on being who you want to be. Because we all have this like version of ourselves that we want to be. Just be that. Like, everyone says, oh, I need to become this person. No, you're not. You know who that person is. You can just be that person. And the more you act like that person, the more you'll slowly, gradually become that person. Everybody is depressed in Dark Souls 2. Sounds like it's time for me to be a therapist. I got you, boys. I got all of y'all, boys. Because I, I have been through it. Okay. I was very depressed myself. I had... An anxiety disorder I, I've been through it all and now I'm so happy and healthy and like mentally I'm doing so well I got you boys oh, it doesn't matter. Just help me item ma check what do you mean I packed my tools in here seeing it was vacant he sounds fun but now somebody's got to lock the door And I have to walk far from my car to my house at night and I'm always afraid of a lion and a bear attacking me. Okay, I get that. But then maybe just park the car next to your house. You start growing on me. <laughs> I hope that's possible.
positive. I'm nothing without my tools. Mm, tools are important for a man, that's true. That's what you'll become if you get parried by a mob in any game! I'm You're not wrong. I'm nothing without my tools. Bring me okay. the key. Bring me the key. Okay, so we need to find him a key. And then that's when we can upgrade as well and all. Ellen, that is really insensitive if you ask me. You can't just go to a person with heavy depression and tell him that. It isn't just sadness, you are not sad. It is a sickness. And you can't just be that person, it's a long hard journey and I really feel attacked because I had depression and you talk all that down and make it seem so easy. It isn't. I understand, Lucky Bear. I get what you're saying. I also went through it. I'm not trying to talk down on it because it took me years as well to get over it. The thing that I'm just trying to get across is that I don't... Depression is a feeling that you have. And feelings are things that can always change. And um, I feel like just saying it's a sickness makes it so that people will keep holding on to it because it is a sickness. So I just have to accept my situation. Where if you look at it as these are feelings that I have and feelings are always something that you can turn around then suddenly there's like a world of opportunities to go through the depression and get out on the good side if you understand what i'm saying i'm not trying to talk down on it i hope that i make that very clear Hey, I don't know where we have to go. There are so many options as to where to go. I'm a little overwhelmed right now. <laughs> Ooh, that's spooky. I don't want to go through there. Gigabyte check? Let me do that. Good idea, good idea. Very delayed for me and buffering all the time. It does seem to be stuck at like a four... Uh, key B. I don't know what that means. Uh, let me check. check if I can fix it a bit. Just like this for everyone? Yeah, I don't really know what it is, because it isn't the internet. I'm not downloading anything in the background. It can't be that. So I'm also a little bit confused as to what is happening. I, I, I hope that... I don't know. I find a way to change it. But I don't really know how to, though. Welcome to my uh, shop. I'm Morlin, and I, well, I sell armor. Oh, sorry, I... Please do have a look at my wares. I could really use the business. If you'd be so kind. Uh, sorry, I'm not kind. I came from the west, from Volgan. Have you been there? It's a lively place. Have a great lurk, I really appreciate my cly. Have a great day. Very competitive, Thank of you. course. And you have to grease the wheels to get anywhere. But I didn't have the funding for that, so I left home in hopes of striking gold. It's been years. Real linear and perfectly balanced path, gotcha. Me very little headway. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm still here. Everything's all run down and dying. It was terrible for business, really. <laughs> I, I, I bet that's true. We need to be more positive. You cannot do anything against your feelings, but you can change the way you handle everything and accept your feelings and build upon that. If you are always so negative and tell yourself shit like it will never happen, yada yada it won't. Mm -hmm. It is a self-fulfilling prophecy when you only talk down your own mm -hmm. self and are being so negative. With a positive attitude you have more energy overall for the things you like, heart. That's absolutely 
true. I fully stand behind that. Also, thank you for the 200 bits in total. I didn't say that before, but thank you so much. I appreciate that. I truly agree with you. And that's kind of what I mean when I say um, that that's why I talk so harsh on like you can change it around because it's about the positive mindset that you need to have to get forward. Just like Thunderbolt said as well, I saw your message. Um, yeah, it is true. Thoughts play a critical part in recovery. I have this, had the same problem and um, honestly, affirmations, they kind of work. They really do. Manifestation, it all really works. It's not just bullshit, you know? People share that knowledge because it works. You buy enough stuff from the NPC trader, he will upgrade his gear. Gotcha. I never buy stuff from traders, though. I don't trust him. No, that's not it. But I just, I don't know. I'm never interested. Trish also was pretty bad for the last few days. Hmm, might be that then. I agree with you at first. It sounded like you're talking down. I'm just sensitive about all that. And I know that you know about it. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to contribute. Just like you. Thank you. I appreciate that. So there was another NPC near the bonfire, is what someone said, right? But then where? Like down here? Ooh, spoopy. Or is that how I got here? No, no, no. I think that's how I got here. Down here? That's not a person, right? Oh, it is. Oh, and she's pretty! Hi, girl! Yes, I am. Then is that like watching in 20 seconds increments? Is it that bad? I will remain by your side till this frail hope shatters. Take this with you. May it ease your journey. Thank you. Of the Emerald Herald. Of the curse. Seek misery. For misery. I don't seek misery. Greater, stronger souls. That's true. Where there's fear, there's growth. That's basically. Are we back? It's still bad. Mine is buffering like hell. It still is bad on my side. Uh, I think it will still be bad. It can't be. I don't think it's still laggy. You know what we're gonna do? I want to give you guys the right content and I want to give, um, I, I want to give you guys something that's watchable, which means I am going to be back tomorrow because I'm not downloading anything. There's nothing in the background. There's not, like no one else is using the internet for downloading, uploading, not even for their phone. Like I have had, the internet off of my phone the whole fucking stream. I didn't put Wi-Fi on, so it can't be that. Um, so that's why I'm guessing there's just like, I, I don't know how to fix it right now. So it might be a problem on Twitch end or on my internet's end, but we're just gonna be back tomorrow. Cause this is like, this is undoable. Uh, I'm not, I, I don't wanna do this to you guys. Um, Hello? Am I... Am I still here? I appreciate Steven squawking fully. Exactly! We need to appreciate Steven squawkings! Let me get a rate message in here. I would still appreciate it if you guys would rate with me. Uh, Wi-Fi. Yes, correct. I do live on the crack. And that means that I don't have actual internet here. I only have Wi-Fi. Apparently not a problem on your side, just Twitch. Yeah, that's what I'm guessing. Because there's like nothing on my end that could cause this. Um... So we will be back tomorrow. I will raid you guys out to someone else. We're gonna go to Tommy Dime. He's playing Dark Souls 3. He's very fun. 
we had a couple of back and forth raids during the Elden Ring days. He's a very, very sweet and energetic man. I really like him. Um, I will be back here tomorrow, 11 a.m. Central European time. Tomorrow? No. Not Sunday, tomorrow to make up for today's stream. Because this is not doable, you know? I'll, I'll just stream like two days in a row. It's fine. It's okay. Okay. Um, I appreciate you all for being here. I appreciate y'all for the support. Thank you for the follows, the subs, the resubs, the gifted subs, the bits. I truly appreciate.